Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. If you're an innovator or an entrepreneur, you've probably wondered, should I patent my idea? Today, we're going to break down when it makes sense to pursue a patent and when you might want to skip the process. Let's dive right in. First, let's talk about when you should consider getting a patent. Reason number one, when the potential profits significantly outweigh the patent costs. Imagine you've launched your product and it starts gaining traction. Competition is inevitable. Without a patent, you'll be competing on price and customer service alone. Let's break this down with an example. Suppose your new gadget hits the market and it's a hit. Sales are soaring and then competition starts to notice. They begin producing similar products, often at a lower price because they didn't have to invest in the initial R&D. Without a patent, you're forced to lower your price or increase your marketing spend to maintain your market share. A patent could give you the exclusive right to your invention. You can force competitors out of your market so that you don't have to lower your price and possibly face being forced out of the market you created. There's no one-size-fits-all answer to what level of profit justifies a patent. It varies depending on your specific situation. However, if you believe that your invention could lead to substantial financial gain, a patent may be worthwhile. Next up, patents are most valuable when your idea has high market potential. High market potential means your invention could generate considerable revenue and attract significant attention and competition. Let's say you've developed a groundbreaking new app that revolutionizes how people manage their daily tasks. If this app takes off, you're going to see a lot of copycats. A patent can protect your market share and ensure you reap the benefits of your hard work. On the flip side, if your idea isn't expected to make a huge impact, it may not be worth the expense of a patent. Competitors may not be inclined to copy something that's not particularly profitable. You won't need a patent. It's for this reason that it's essential to do a thorough market research to understand the potential reach and revenue of your idea before deciding on a patent. Reason number three, if your invention is a crucial component or feature of your product line, protecting it with a patent can be strategic. For example, if you've developed a unique technology that significantly improves the battery life of your electronics. This feature is critical to the success of your entire product line that contains a battery. A patent ensures that you maintain a competitive edge and safeguard the uniqueness of your offerings. By protecting key features, you ensure that competitors can't easily replicate what makes your entire product line special. This can be especially important in industries where innovation drives consumer interest and sales. Finally, if competitors could easily copy your idea, a patent is essential. Let's say you've created a new kitchen gadget that simplifies a common cooking task. It's a simple design, but highly effective. Larger companies with more resources could quickly replicate and mass produce it, leaving you in the dust. A patent can prevent these larger companies from copying your idea outright. While a patent may not stop them entirely, it can compel them to modify their approach or seek a licensing agreement from you. This way, you can monetize your invention through licensing deals where other companies pay you to use your patented technology or by keeping the competitive advantage exclusively to yourself. Now, let's talk about when you might skip the patent process. Sometimes, trade secret protection is more effective than patent protection. Trade secrets can protect manufacturing methods, internal procedures, and other proprietary information that's difficult to reverse engineer. For instance, the formula for Coca-Cola is a well-guarded trade secret. If your idea can be effectively safeguarded through confidentiality and isn't easily discovered or replicated by competitors, maintaining it as a trade secret might be a better option. Unlike patents, trade secrets don't expire as long as the secret remains undisclosed. This means your competitive advantage can potentially last indefinitely. However, it's crucial to have robust confidentiality agreements and security measures in place to protect your trade secrets. Deciding whether to patent your idea involves weighing the cost against the potential benefits. Consider the financial implications, market potential, and the nature of your invention. Remember, a patent isn't just a protective measure, it's a strategic tool that can significantly impact your business's success. Evaluate your unique situation carefully to determine the best path forward. And if you need help working through the process, 
feel free to give me a call. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more tips on innovation and entrepreneurship.